So the other day, me and my friend were talking about Battlefield and how he had transitioned to playing a load of Call of Duty to playing a lot more Battlefield. And I was saying, you know what, whenever I play Battlefield and make a video on it, I end up playing it for a lot longer than I ever intended to. And I have a load of fun. I honestly really enjoy it. And he pointed out, and I'd completely forgotten, that there's actually a very similar mode to gun game in Battlefield 4. Now, I played this back on Battlefield 3 years ago, but have never touched it since on Battlefield 4. So I thought, you know what, I love gun game on all Call of Duty. Let's give this a go. It's called Gun Master on Battlefield 4. If you enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you want to see more. So let's jump into this. Give it a go for the first time and see how I can do. Alright, so it's welcome, I guess. My very first Gun Master game on Battlefield 4. Notice that little bar at the bottom of the screen. That's the pro progressional ranks. Each bar represents a different gun. But rather than getting one kill with each gun, you need two kills with each gun to progress. I'm going to go for a sneaky route. I feel like there's a load of people around here. I don't know. It's also teams, not free for all, which is a big difference. Where is the enemies? Here they are. Here they are. There's one. Is that a dude there? Nope, that's not a person. So yeah, as you can see, I've got to get two to progress. It is quite a long progressional system, to be honest. It's really good fun. I think it mixes it up quite a lot, having it as team, rather than... Here we go, so there's one. There's another one. Let's be careful here. We are towards the enemy's territory, so... Another one. Nice, 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 nice. I'm going to wait here for him to potentially come by. There we go. Oh my gosh. I'm on eight health! Help me! I'm going for a risky play. Screw it. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Run, 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 run. I know there's an enemy near here. There we go. Nice. Good progression. I can hear footsteps everywhere. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Help me. I'm surrounded. I know I'm surrounded. Oh my gosh. There's gunfire going off everywhere. There's an enemy over here. Hold on. I'm going for a sneaky play. What is he doing? I'm going to go through here. Hopefully he doesn't flank around. This is a Desert Eagle. It's powerful. But you've got to be damn accurate with it. Oh, come on. Well, the good news is we're at the top of the tier system at the moment. All of those little indicators show you where everyone is. Here's an enemy. There we go. Beautiful. Dude, some of the guns in this game are just so much fun to use. But despite it being team-based, only one person can win. So it's still like a free-for-all in the same sense. That was terrible, Ali. What are you doing? And there's one person above us right now. How is that not hitting? Ah! Ah! Run, I'm exposed! Dude, I think I got a mad flank route here. Yes, I do. Nice. Thank you. I don't know what this weapon is. I don't even know if it's automatic. No, I don't think it is. It's got 11 bullets, so I assume it's going to be single fire. Go hit marker. What was that? The respawns in this mode are long, so I'd say just, just staying alive will do you wonders in this mode. Double kill. Oh, beautiful double kill. We progressed. That's the main thing. We're good. All right, we're up with the big boys. But we're in the big boy position right now on the top tier. Oh, no, someone's just progressed. It's all right, though. It's fine. We've got an LMG. One down. I am going to go behind this dude. Boom. That is what I'm talking about. I'm going to go for a flank route here. No, oh, look at that. What is, what is this gun set up, man? They were literally spawning in front of me, but it's fine. It's fine. I got the progressional kill to get to the next round. Whoa. What? <laughs> but like five enemies in the front of me. I don't want to get you guys too excited, but we are currently at the highest, highest tier right now. I bet everyone that's on the server, that is. There's one guy. There's another guy. Nice. Oh, dude, we're at the top, but we've only got a shotgun. What am I meant to do in this situation? Boom! Shoot people, that's what you meant to do, Ali. Oh! We literally killed each other and said, I thought I was still reloading. Dude, is this a UMP? Boys, this is sick. I'll take this gun. Again, we're at the top. Somehow, I haven't played Battlefield in months, but somehow we are at the top of the leaderboard, which is awesome. Ooh, nice one. One kill with the UMP. Make that two, boys. Oh, cheeky three-piece right there. Oh, it's a burst gun. I didn't even realize. Ali, why am I such a battlefield noob? All right, so apparently I got an assist, which counted as a kill. And I got progressed. But we're no longer at the top. Of top. Oh, my gosh. This gun is terrible. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think I got, I think I got that. I think I got that. I was about to say, how did that dude not die? You know what I mean? 
What is this thing? It's like an SMG AK or something? It's kind of mad. Nice! Got that! Got that! I need to stop dying, though. <laughs> Ooh. We're on to the snipers. One. Got one sniper kill. Ooh, this could be a... Oh, hit markers. Oh, I counted. Yes, 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 yes. All right, nice. Oh, my gosh. Everything's going down right now. Oh, look at this. What? Oh, it's a magnum, dude. That's a... Oh, what is... Dude, maybe it's like a mad pistol. There's so many sick guns in this game that I don't even realize. I remember playing it when the Deagle actually got first released. And I played the game for hours just to get the Deagle. Oh, my gosh. I thought it was going to get stuck there. Right, I'm definitely within enemy territory right now, so I've got to be careful. I can hear... I... Oh gosh, that's, that's not good. Oh, one shot though. I'm getting out of there. I should not have survived that at all. We are currently joint with a few other guys on this point, at uh, this position though. I need to be careful. I can't challenge anyone. Okay, I've got to get back inside. I've got to get back inside. I'm going back to the way I came. I'm going to go back to the way I came. There's one, there's one, there's one. Another one, there's another one, there's another one. Run, 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 run. Oh, there, I was literally in their spawn. Oh my gosh, dude. So apparently this is the second to last weapon, which means I cannot, I cannot afford to die right now. There's going to be, this is so, this is my first ever full gun game on Battlefield 4, for those guys wondering. But, it's no excuse. Oh, an assist, are you serious? I'm spamming this thing so hard. I'm spamming this thing so hard. There's one, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one, I'm on eight health. I'm on eight health. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. It's a knife. Oh my gosh. Final kill and I win. Don't get shot in the back. Please, 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 please. No! He heard the alarm go off. I'm on the knife, dude. If I get his kill, I win. Oh my gosh. The knife, knife hunt begins. I'm still the only one on the knife, but this is so intense. Oh my gosh. They're right above me. They're literally right above me. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go for a different route. Hold on. Hold on. Here we go. Here we go. I see you. Come back. Please. Please. Stop sprinting. No. Here we go. No. No. What? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. This could be the flank of the century for the game winning kill. I can't climb up there. I can't climb up there. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. I feel so sneaky. So sneaky. So quiet. Here we go. This could be the one. Do not turn around. Do not turn around. What? 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 What just happened at the end there? I didn't win. And I literally knifed him like in the body. I don't even. I don't even. I was like, boys, that is it. That's that's it. Locked and loaded. Game set match. And we, we go and lose. <laughs> Dude, that was still so, so much fun, man. As I said, whenever I play Battlefield, I end up having a load of fun. I'm playing for a lot more than I even intended to. If you guys want to see me play again and try and actually win and uh, not get... I don't know what even happened at the end there for my knife. And give it a thumbs up. I've had a load of fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's awesome to mix it up. You've been awesome. And I'll see you guys next time with another video. Potentially I have outside my hotel window one of the best views I've ever had outside a hotel window and potentially this could be one of the greatest trips I've ever been on and hopefully this could be one of the greatest vlogs I've ever filmed for you guys. Where am I? What is going on? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Oh my gosh. This is the view from my hotel room. This is Corsica baby. But what on earth am I doing in Corsica? Just Cause 3 is coming out in December and I have been sent out here to do some crazy, crazy activities. Skydiving, jet skiing, you name it, we're going to be doing some absolutely nut stuff here in this beautiful, beautiful island. So I told you guys this could be one of my greatest vlogs ever and I am pumped. This is day number one. Earlier today we had a presentation and a first look at Just Cause 3. I've got to play it for an hour and a half. We got up to some crazy stuff. Alright, so I've cleared out all of these enemies, but they, they need to be punished for what they did, alright? <laughs> this, this is their leader. 
<laughs> and show them why they should not mess. <laughs> Boy! He's, he's gone! He's gone! Oh my god! <laughs> I literally spent about an hour and a half, the whole time pretty much, just slingshotting people off that statue as far as I could. I said one person, 650 meters, absolutely insane. So this island, Corsica, is extremely similar to the island that's based off of Just Cause 3. Now today, we've got some crazy activities. We're gonna be starting on top of a mountain, working our way down the mountain, jumping on jet skis, and then jet skiing somewhere. That's as much as I know so far. That's only the start, that's only today. Tomorrow, skydiving. Now I hate heights, like on a level, I am not good with heights. Why would I want to do skydiving? Because it's like one of those things you just don't get to do every day. I had to go and get a doctor's note like the day before I came on this trip to say I could do the skydiving. So two days of epic activities. This is going to be day number one. I cannot wait to take you guys with me. Hopefully you enjoy this as much as I think I'm going to enjoy it. So let's do it. We found a sleeping Vic. I'm going to wake him up. Look, I think he's texting in his sleep. Oh my god, he is, he is, he is, he is. <laughs> Oh my god. So I stupidly came to a place like this and forgot my swimming trunks. I had to go and get some new swimming trunks. That is literally our hotel right there. And this, look at the view. Look at the view. It is absolutely insane. So we've got a few hours free before the activities start. The whole sort of jet skiing and going down the mountain thing. So we are going to hit the pool. It's an infinity pool just there. And uh, have a bit of downtime, a bit of chill time before the craziness kicks off. Yo, that pool was actually amazing, dudes. Oh my gosh. That pool was so good. I've never been in an infinity pool before, but it was worth it. Now we just jumped out the pool, had food, and prepared ourselves for the main activities for the day. And we're going up, as I said, the mountain. We're gonna do some crazy stuff. We've just been informed of what we're actually gonna be doing. I don't want to give it all away, but it's gonna be a lot of stuff back to back to back to back to back happening right now. I, I am mad pumped. I'm not even thinking about the skydiving tomorrow. I'm thinking just about the stuff we're about to do right now. So pool, chill time over, and more intense activity times. We're actually in teams, I believe. We're in teams, so this is actually gonna be competitive, and I wanna smash it. So guys, so we're about to go down. I'll take you with me, let's do this. So the activities begin. We've been dropped off in a bus, and the bus has left us on top of this massive mountain. It's hard to show you guys, but you should be able to see over there the coast. And I told you guys we're going up a mountain and working our way down, so this is where it all begins. All right, it's all about to kick off. Look at that view. So we're starting up here, and we're going down there. I thought it'd be more things along the way, but apparently not. We've got a map. We've got our team down here. One, two, three, four, five. Vic, where are you, Vic? My dude, Vic. He's on our team as well. We're going to smash it with team number one. Are we team red? Uh, team one. Team pink, whatever this thing is. It's orange, bro. <laughs> Alright, that, that is our colour as well, so we're actually competing against all of these, all these scrubs mate, they're going down, they're going down. Uh, so this is going to be a close one, we're going to kick it off, we're actually wasting time vlogging, so I'm going to vlog as we go. Let's go! Alright, this is where we start, and this is the end point, you see it, you see it? We're going to try and get there as quickly as possible, checkpoints along the way, bonus points, that is the destination right there baby. Vic, you right, bro? Yeah, man. Dude, um, these shoes are not made for this, <laughs> help me! Oh, whoa! Boys, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I think that tactical stick's probably a good shout, yeah, to be honest. I think we've gone from being the first group to leave <laughs> to being the last group. Alright, we've been walking for like legit like half an hour, we're nowhere near the bottom, so boys, we're just gonna nick this car. Actually, no, it looks kind of dead. Do you think we should do it? Oh my gosh, it's like a dead. What the heck? Nah, boys, things abandoned. Let's not, let's not. Alright, we're, we're continuing on foot, we're continuing on foot. Right, I don't want to surprise you guys, but after I decided not to cheat, I can see water. Like, that's not far. <laughs> Honestly, I thought this trip was going to take like hours, but looks, unfortunately, okay, okay, let's, I'm going to put my hands up. We, we did get overtaken. We did get overtaken. Honestly, Vic and I, we were taking pictures, man, for you guys. That's <laughs> our excuse, right? But this is where even more stuff starts. So, oh, we didn't take that picture for the bonus points. No, we didn't. We didn't see anything. Ah. Okay, well, it's fine. 
challenge number one oh was complete. <laughs> We've made it, taking my shoes off already. Look at me strapped up, making sure that everything, this by the way, is my team bandana for those of you guys that are wondering. And it looks like, you see over there, I think, we're gonna be going rafting next. So, man, I'm hyped, this is sick so far. This, I can see the jet skis as well. You don't understand how hyped I am for the jet skis. All right, boys, we're on the beach. Next up, jet skis. After jet skiing, falling in, I think two or three times, losing the hat, we still have a camera and we're still alive. It was so sick. I wanted to go out there and smash it again. These things are so much fun, but every wave, up and down, up and down. Am I sitting in the right way? So we are off the jet skis. Now we are making a transfer on this has been crazy and I've just had a little bit of downtime in between doing all the activities back to back to back compete against all the other teams. As you can see the sun is sort of setting behind me. We just have time for one more activity which is arguably one of the better ones as well which is going to be paintballing in there. My teammates are getting ready and hopefully my Call of Duty skills can transfer over a little bit. I don't really do real shooting but guys remember what was the first Call of Duty I played? Call of Duty on the Wii. 
obviously how did you aim? You have to physically aim, all right? So <laughs> we'll see how this goes, we'll see how this goes. Apparently there's a, a similar setting within the Just Cause 3 game like this with a big shootout, I think. So it's sort of replicating that a little bit. But as I said, there's been lots of teams. We've been apparently the salmon team. I did have the armband on, but I took it off because it was just getting in the way a little bit. Um, and so far we're doing well in terms of the timings and the scorings, I reckon. So I'll keep you guys updated on how that goes. Whew. All right, guys, time for paintball and let's smash this. All right, the score we're trying to beat between five of us is 140. Will, our first teammate, is gone. Five shots, pretty good. I think that's a 10 right there, body shot. So, so far we're looking good. We've got four more of us to go. 140 points we need total if we want to get a first place in this. All right, round two, guys, we screwed up. Like, no, no lie, we screwed up. Um, we decided to go for this target, six bullets each. One went there, one got zero. So that's five points. I think on average you need like 30 points each. All right, now I got you. Yeah, Ali's good. got to perform. You know what I mean? All right, concentration. All right. Where'd that go? Five. Five points. Oh, that's not good. Five. Ooh, that's a ten. ten. Boys! That was nice. Sick. <laughs> Let's go in. Okay, we're good, we're good. How many points was it? That was two tens in there, I swear. Yeah, I think it was three. Is that three? No, the last one was a ten. I'm zoomed in. <laughs> How many points was it for that one? Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven points. I just, I, what I did, right, so the first shot went there, and I was aiming here, so I just started aiming on the body there, and the shot went pow, pow. It's a good score. All right, final member of the team has gone. Most of the bullets going around here. I think 32 was the total, so I think we've done all right. I don't know if it's enough. But we've done good. All right, that is it. The day is over. Started with jet skiing, ended with paintballing. I mentioned we needed 144 to come first in that. I think we've got 140. I am blaming you, it's your fault. <laughs> Because we're not violent in Denmark, you know. Because he sucks. No, 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 we're just like another violent... Uh, yeah. Nice people, right? Nice people. Didn't I do a lot better than he did? You did, you did. Are we not both Danish? Yeah, it's true. Average out, you're fine, you're fine. He got five points. What? We were... what? Oh, no, 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 no. I got, I got at least ten. Oh. And we were four points off the winner. I will never see a YouTube channel. Never. never. <laughs> so, it's alright, it's alright. We cannot complain. I think we may have come second in there, but we've got one more team to go. So for the moment, this beautiful sunset, look at this, look at that. For the moment, it's time to head back after a day of adventuring and see which team has taken the win. Remember guys, skydiving's tomorrow. I haven't really been thinking about it, to be honest. Um, when I do start thinking about it, it's probably going to freak me out a little bit for the moment, but it's all good. I'm going to refresh up, head back to the hotel and see who's won after this day of challenge. Guys, it's the end of the day and where better to finish it than an amazing restaurant literally looking out to sea. I get here and I'm like, this is sick, this is an amazing way to finish a day. Then I sit down and they're serving me sushi, which we absolutely destroy and I'm feeling good right now. We don't quite yet know the winners, however. I think we're gonna get the winners results here tonight of a dinner. We're just sitting down, getting some drinks and finishing off the food, but look at this place. Literally beautiful, looking straight out onto Corsica. I believe we've come from around here where the hotel is and we've come all the way around to where we are now. And this is where day number one of activities and craziness is going to finish. So fingers crossed we've got a good position and we've proved ourselves. Team UK and Denmark it ended up being. A few of the awesome guys from Denmark. So hopefully the next time I see you guys I'll have good news. Uh, guys it's results time. This is it. Listen up. The team won. Oh. We came third. Damn. I want first. We one. came third, mid table. I'm, gut I'm actually gutted. Decidedly mediocre, but points. hey, it's all right. And we had fun, right? Minutes. Really? Well, this is it. Back where we all started, and this is where it's going to end for today. Third place in the end. Honestly, like I genuinely thought we may get first, but there were a few challenges. We're just like a little bit, a little bit too slow. Didn't quite perform as well. We could have done. But in all honesty, it's nothing about that, was it? It's all just about the crazy activities and having a load of fun. I hope you guys really enjoyed today as well. It was it was epic. And, and obviously trips like this are a great sort of break for me to do something crazy and something awesome. But like today's been nuts and obviously not many people get to experience something like this. So I feel like it's my own responsibility to take you guys with me and turn it to something you guys can enjoy and experience as well. And hopefully I've managed to fulfill that because 
these things, like, to be able to do as much as I did today in one day is nuts. And it's been absolutely insane. Uh, it's just been awesome. Hopefully you guys really enjoyed it as well. But there's still one thing left. And you're probably thinking, Ali, where is the skydiving? And that's happening tomorrow. Now, we need to be up early tomorrow, so I'm going to rest up. We've done so much today. This is going to be the first video, and skydiving is going to be coming out very, very soon. So look out for it. Hopefully, you've really enjoyed this video. If you have, a big fat thumbs up. We really, really appreciate it for something different, for something as epic as this trip. And look out, my friends, very, very soon for some skydiving craziness. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon.